They have some really great uh, photographs here. This is M51, the Whirlpool Nebula, a Hubble telescope picture. Excellent, fantastic detail. And this is the uh, Eagle Nebula. And as uh, so we walk over here, okay. I'm standing next, next to the original Moon Man, the one and only. On Spain. And uh, everything profound to say tonight? Now, once upon a time, in the old days, there was a, this cow. This cow loved the moon. Yeah. And so at one time, he'd figure out, that doesn't look that far away when it's rising. I think I'll build up my speed, see if I can jump over. So there he goes. There he goes. He's getting as fast as he can. Went on that little hill. He's hopping. And he did it. The cow jumped over the moon. There you have it, straight from the moon man's mouth. Wow. I often wonder how that rumor got, or story got started, excuse me. Yeah. yeah. It was actually a Jersey cow. A, Jer a Jersey. Oh, that's, that's important to know. Yeah. All right. Well, this is definitely a cool place. Let's walk over here. These are the meteorites. This case is full of all sorts and all types of real meteorites that came from outer space. We have stony iron, we have iron meteorites, we have quite a collection. And inside the auditorium here, there's a program in progress. Let's see, you moved over here so you could do what now? So this is an equatorial mount, mm -hmm. and this axis right here is supposed to point north. Right. And okay. when I set it up, I just set it up real quick so that the public could look at the moon, right. and that was pointed in the wrong direction. So hopefully it'll be tracking a lot better now. Right. Close enough. Close enough. As we say, close enough uh, in jazz, we say close enough for jazz. Yeah. All right, now. I may not be tracking the greatest. I did not align very well. I bought mine here. I tell it to go and find an object. <laughs> 